Let me tell you something you already know. I'm Dave Kirloff with the language of hitting.com. I have four short topics to go over today. Number one, cultural programming. Number two, cultural deprogramming. Number three, replace it with the correct switch. And number four, my hitting product. So what is cultural programming in terms of hitting in baseball and softball? Well, basically it's just the trends, the fads that the hitting coaches are using with our hitters. Back in the early 90s when I started into this business, the fad was, you know, squish the bug, turn on your back foot. And this trend and fad stuck for decades. And what eventually happened to it? Well, coaches learned they had to actually to learn how to deprogram the hitter from doing it. Bring us up to speed, what is our current fad or current trend that's going on in our hitting community? Let's get more bat speed. Let's get more launch angles. That's what's going on. And for most of the hitters, what is this trend producing? It produces over swinging. It produces a disconnection with vision. So which leads me to number two, deprogramming. Deprogramming the cultural trends. When I travel from city to city or I have uh, my home lessons in my own facility, you know, a lot of times players are coming to me and they're having these issues where they overswing and um, they're getting disconnected with their vision and their timing is broken. And as a hitting coach, probably one of my biggest challenges is to help the hitter and help the parents identify that this is your issue. You're over swinging and you're trying to create launch angle and bat speed in an incorrect manner. And that leads me to the next topic. Replace it. Replace the trend and fad with a system, a formula, a recipe that really works. I like to refer it to as a switch. Every player is going to have a switch that's going to turn on the mechanism of hitting. And basically, our culture is training our hitters to use a switch that says smash the ball. Hit the ball as far as you can. And the, the real switch that I'm training hitters to identify with is something that the elite hitters are born with. They're born with a switch I refer to as timed perception or timed spatial awareness. You see, when you use a switch of timed perception, you're actually gonna get the results that you really want. You're going to get the results of hitting with more launch angle and more bat speed and you're not even going to try to do it. Why does time perception work and achieve these goals? It's because it has to deal with the brain. I mean, it's very obvious. If you would just step back and look at the elite hitters and understand they're doing something differently with their brains that the common hitter doesn't do. And what they do so special is I call time spatial awareness or timed perception. Let me give you my recommendation. My recommendation is this, my product. Look at my product and it begins with the, the best hitting drill ever, the third and fourth edition. The best hitting drill ever is a starting point for your hitter, whether it be baseball or softball, to learn the foundational principle that, that sets up what is timed spatial awareness or timed perception. And once you learn that, you can graduate into the bigger program, the world's greatest hitting formula. The world's greatest hitting formula is where I discuss what is the pitcher's common denominator? There's a common de denominator for a baseball pitcher and there's a common denominator for a fast pitch softball pitcher. The other part that I have is to come see me face to face. Come and visit me in my home facility or come visit me in one of my, the cities I visit. 
The advantages of seeing me face to face is this. Number one, I'm going to work specifically with your player in a small group setting. Or you can choose to work with me one on one. Number two, I'm going to accurately assess your player's hitting model and your player's hitting tempo. Number three, I'm going to teach your player how to accurately time the pitcher's common denominator. And number four, your hitter is going to learn the deep attributes of what is timed perception. In a nutshell, I'm going to teach your hitter how to pay more attention to the ball. As soon as all this happens, you're going to see your hitter take off. You're going to see your hitter produce better in the games. They're going to achieve the goals that they set out to achieve as a hitters, and they're going to have more fun playing the game. What else are you waiting for? Make the investment because your player is worth it. Let's help our kids to be as good as they can be while they're still young. I'm Dave Kirloff, languageofhitting.com, and Lord bless you.